Good morning from Let Us Eat. Today I'm going to be making crock pot shredded pork. Very easy dump and go recipe. I already have the pork into the crock pot. The crock pot preheated because it is a pork based meal to ensure that it's fully cooked by 3 4 o'clock this afternoon. I'm going to be doing my semi homemade barbecue sauce. I'm going to take a whole bottle of the barbecue sauce. I'm going to add some brown sugar. I'm going to add a little bit of ketchup. You seem to be almost out of ketchup, so I have to put that on my list for this weekend. A little bit of fresh black cracked pepper. I'm also going to put some on the pork. And also on the pork, I'm going to go ahead and put my bell peppers and frozen onions, some into the barbecue sauce, and the rest into the pork. I'm going to add my crushed tomatoes into the crock pot. Take my mom's wooden spoon. Still have it. She's been gone over 20 years now. Here's the barbecue sauce. Semi homemade because I didn't add every single ingredient ingredient into it. Oh, this smells so good. I'm gonna put this into the crock pot. Now that the barbecue sauce is on the crock pot, I'm going to stir the crock pot and make sure all the crushed tomatoes and the barbecue sauce 
and the pork is all spread around in the crock pot. crock pot has all the ingredients. It has the shredded pork, a can of crushed tomatoes. It has a semi-homemade barbecue sauce, some frozen peppers and onions, and it has some garlic and fresh black cracked pepper to taste. On my Facebook page, Let Us Eat, Suzanne Ridgway, I will show some photos of the crock pot and on the inside of it, as well as my regular face page and of Suzanne Poole and Ridgway on Instagram. I'm going to keep the crock pot on low till about 3 4 o'clock. Then I'm going to put it to keep warm until dinner time. Thank you always for watching Let Us Eat. If you like this recipe and my video, please give it a like and please subscribe. I have a small audience and I'd like to see it grow. I do videos daily. Tomorrow I'm going to be doing old-fashioned beef goulash in my crock pot. And Thursday I'm going to be doing old-fashioned meatloaf in my crock pot. Look forward to those videos and have a great day. Bye!